but at this point, again, our build can just pretty much move through everything. We're gonna be taking damage, but healing with everything. And I was hoping to get it done in under six minutes, but there it is. All right, we're back for more Swarm Grinder, and welcome to How to Beat the Game in Under 8 Minutes, Part 1. I'm not really a big speed running dude, but I don't know, there's something about this game that makes me want to beat it in under 8 minutes over and over again. Okay, so I'm going to call this one the Butcher Cleaver Stop and Go Your Way to Under 8 Minutes. <laughs> and anyway, it's going to involve really mainly just the Cleaver, and then, and then mostly Arsenal and Lucky Charm for crit, Arsenal for the damage and blades count, and the local heal, and then the crits from Lucky Charm. That's pretty much it. And then this is what my meta progression right now is looking like. Funnily enough, I don't really have, I only have one for movement speed. Anyway, let's go. Let us go, Butcher. And hope for some early Cleaver upgrades and some good sub lamos there to start. No Cleaver, but we get Arsenal for some early global damage. We want that for sure. And at the start here, we can afford to not do a lot of stopping and going just because there's not a lot of enemies yet. Now we get a cleaver. Let's get... So these are the two things we want. Crit chance and wider blades. At least for this build particularly. And I'm heading up here. And I'm trying to observe. I'm still new to this whole... I'm still mastering this whole beating the game in under 8 minutes. Oh my gosh, what is this? Fine, I'll keep it at the blades though. Realm of the blades with Vortex Blades. But it's not my preferred pickup. Um, is there like a most efficient way in choosing which direction of station you should go for? Oh my goodness, what is this now? Fine, I will take some detonator then. Maybe a mortar wouldn't have been too bad, but that would have slowed down our fuel. Okay, give me some good ones now. Here we go, Lucky Charm. Yes, global crit chance is at 8%. Let's head to the upper right here. So I'm just trying, I don't know, because I don't know yet, again, the most efficient choices in directions to take. So I'm just trying to balance it out. Like, next time I'm going to head, um, let's get Arsenal here for some heal. Yes. Oh, we also want global count. And this time I'm going to head to the left. Just to make sure that in my mind, I'm kind of keeping the center, if that makes sense, of my navigating. Am I making sense here? Like, I don't want to go too far in one direction and then find myself having to look for the um, the next... Do I have Lucky Charm? I do. Give me Arsenal, though, for more global count. I don't want to find myself, like, looking for the next station, which is, um, like, I don't know, 40, 50, even more meters away. Now we are at the, the ninth station, is this? No. The eighth one. Blades, crit chance. Now we got area. We got eight stations, so at this point, we, we are going to start our stopping and going. Just to make sure that we are not overwhelming ourselves with too many enemies. We make sure we kill almost everyone who we spawn. Let's get more cleaver here. Let's get the uh, crit. No, area, area. Let's get more efficient with area now. This is, yep, going to be the, uh, the first boss. Who we actually wouldn't, um, at this point, since we're still pretty weak, it'll take too much time to, um, to, uh, what do you call this? To spend all our time on him, killing him. So we're gonna keep moving here, still stopping and going. This whole, this, um, spawn, this wave will definitely help. And us clearing more areas here. And now he is almost done. Here comes Arsenal, but I'm gonna pick up. Actually, you know what? Yeah, give me Arsenal here for more blades damage. Oh, I want all of these, but let's get blades damage. 25%. That should make getting this. Um, okay. See what I mean when you pay too much attention to the boss? You end up losing your way. Uh, heal on kill. Let's get. I'm actually gonna get heal on kill too. So that we can start burn chance explosion. Taking damage. Now we're gonna be taking damage. So that's a no. We'll take explosion damage one. What's our timer looking like? Three minutes. We are 
almost halfway. We're a bit slow, I would say. We need a faster pace than this. But we are, we do, we have started to, um, got, get everything we want here. Let's get wider blades again. Stop, go. Stop, go. Get patience. And this is where the healing on kill comes into play. Because we are going to be in contact with a lot of damage. But every time Butcher swings those blades, we get healing, we get our health back. Lucky Charm Arsenal, let's get more Arsenal here. Global count. Mm. Let me get... Okay, blades. I'm actually going to get blades damage here. Okay. Stop. Go. Stop. Go. Maybe I stopped there too early. <laughs> okay. Uh, cleaver, let's go. This is the uh, fifth one. Blades crit chance. Movement speed. Okay, let's head up. Almost four minutes in. We are more than halfway though. So blammo, that was a good drop. Um, Arsenal for global count. Yes. Okay. Stop. Go. Be patient. Because uh, um, we don't want to get ourselves killed, for, first of all. Good. We are getting there. Cleaver. Here we go. Shredder. That should make things a lot easier. That should make our healing a lot more efficient. Uh, and that should make our stopping and going a lot more efficient. We are... Okay. We're doing pretty good with our pace. Arsenal. More arsenal. Yes. Four global damage times two. Ooh. I ah, will get it. I think that's still... I'm not gonna do... I'm gonna try not to do any math, specific math right now, but I, I think the uh, the times two damage pretty much trumps everything else there. Okay, more arsenal. Um, this is heal on kill three already. We will get global count. Make sure we are shredding our way through at this point. Uh, I don't want to get too overconfident and say that we can mow our way out of here. Perhaps with some more heal on kill, we can. This is a 20th. And also the next boss. This is gonna be chaotic. Where is the next station? We gotta keep our eyes on the prize. Look at him, we're gonna shred him right now. Um, we'll get more cleaver because we want more movement speed. Five minutes, we have five more to go. We gotta go, we gotta go. Did we kill the boss anyway? I'm not even sure if I oh, we did not kill him yet. Okay. Um, arsenal, Vortex Blade. Let's get more Arsenal for more blade damage. There you go. Detonator. Eh, okay. Active Explosion Chance. Not really, but okay. Movement Speed. Let's go. Four more to go. At this point, we can mow our way. We'll still do some pickups here. Even though we don't have to, but we'll get Cleaver. Three more to go. Since we have the really good healing and we're shredding a lot, it'll be easy to keep going though. Lucky Charm, Global, ooh, no crit chance? Okay, crit damage then. It's gonna be the last two, um, what do you call this? The last two fields, clear the last field, it's a bit far, but we have two minutes to spare. Well, less than two minutes to spare. But at this point, again, our build can just pretty much move through everything. We're going to be taking damage, but healing with everything. And I was hoping to get it done in under six minutes, but there it is. Six minutes and 15 seconds, so that is just one way to get the achievement. You can actually see our build over here very good and focused. We actually didn't really need these two very much. Of course they help, but it's really upgrading Cleaver. Arsenal, especially heal and kill for that particular build we had and then getting more crit Although we actually did not end up getting a lot of crit from lucky charm. Okay, that was just part one We'll be back with more ways to beat the game in under eight minutes Probably with bullet storm next time leave a like in the video if you enjoyed it It really helps the channel out and please do consider subscribing for those who are still watching at this point Do leave a comment on how you guys went about beating the game in under eight minutes I'd very much like to hear like what your builds were like and maybe like how crazy or how fast you got it done But for now, I'll see you guys in the next one